Wow. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I, are there, do, do you happen to know, Ethan, whether or not there's a number of people who will have the official you know, page and then their own that they do for more personal use? Yeah, can you help me find this guy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um, you know, there are basically two different types of profiles. You can have a Facebook, here, there's a personal pro profile, and then there's a Facebook page, which is really a public-facing profile. Right. The biggest difference is that uh, for your personal profile, it's uh, friend your friendships, you have two-way connections, right? You both have to say, yes, we are friends. Whereas a fan page is like Twitter, anybody can follow um, and can just by clicking like can, can receive updates from it. Right. I would assume we're up at 500 million monthly users. So I assume almost everyone who's actually has a Facebook page probably has a personal one. We have really good privacy controls so you can lock it down so you can't be found in search and things like that. Uh, but it's such a great tool at, to use for personal uses um, that I'm sure everybody has a, do you have a, do you have a Facebook profile? I don't actually, no. I'm sitting here moderating this. He might be the only person. That I say that. <laughs> And I, I thought he, I was afraid he was going to ask me that too. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm huge on Twitter, actually. I love it. Um, but uh, but there are definitely is, different use cases for sure. Like uh -huh. fa the Facebook personal profile is like that's where you see like pictures of your nephews and nieces right. and you know talk to your mom and right. share photos of where what where you're having breakfast, regardless of who you are, right? right. And so certainly if you're like a public persona, which like you all are, yeah. I can see you might not want to post like pictures of your nephews and nieces on your like public facing page. Right. Right. 